Welcome to this 10 minute meditation that explores our tendencies towards feeding our inner critic and inner ego. When we engage in a new hobby, a new job, a new relationship, a new project, our inner critic loves to get involved. It likes to break our ego and tell us we aren't good enough or that people will soon work out we are a fraud or an imposter. High achievers and perfectionists usually suffer imposter syndrome the most. Your brain is like a neural circuit switch. What you believe, you embody. And what you embody, you become. This is why it's so important to feed our minds with love, kindness and friendliness if the imposter syndrome strikes. We're now going to begin our practice by taking a deep breath in and a deep breath out. As you feel your feet on the floor, your hands resting in your lap, just softening your gaze, your body long through the spine, your heart soft and gently closing down your eyes. Tuning into your body and noticing any sensations as you relax. Inhaling deeply and exhaling slowly. Feeling the gentle rise and fall of your stomach. As your breath deepens and softens, just feeling the weight of your body growing heavy. Long breath in and a long breath out. Each time you breathe out, letting your body sink deeper into the chair and letting any tension melt away. With each breath you take, feeling the body soften and releasing. If it helps, you can count one with the inhale and two with the exhale. One with the inhale and two with the exhale. Bringing your attention now to your heart center as you focus on your mantra for today. I am doing my best. I am creating the life I want. Now dialing down the volume on the mantra and not just saying the words but really believing in them. I am doing my best. I am creating the life I want. Now I whisper. I am doing my best. I am creating the life I want. Now saying it in your mind for the next few minutes.
Gently start bringing your attention back into the body. The sensation of your feet, your hands resting in your lap. Gently start bringing your attention back into the body. The sensation of your feet, your hands resting in your lap. Starting to notice any sounds, any smells. Just bring your awareness back into the room. You're not alone with perfectionism or the imposter syndrome. Everyone feels like this at one time or another, usually when we're embarking on something new. The people that succeed are the ones that soften their judgments and criticism. Having the self-belief that you're more ready than you realize, to feel the fear and just do it anyway. Not only does mindfulness teach us to be in the moment, it also improves our compassion and our empathy towards ourself. Taking a deep breath in and a deep breath out. Just taking a moment now to notice how your body feels. And taking a moment of gratitude for taking the time out to nourish your mind. Before getting up, just gently reciting these words. Today, I'm going to get out of my own way. I believe in myself and I am proud of what I do. Then when you're ready, ever so gently, opening up your eyes. Taking this brave, confident state with you into the day.